Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is David Carter. And I'm Reggie Walker. And this is Locker Room Talk. And today's show is brought to you by Strategic Advisory Board and Game Within the Game. The Game Within the Game is the first and only college accredited course written for student athletes by professional athletes on how to make a big impact during and after your careers. And so, what's today's show about, bro? Oh, today, I love this. We're, so we're going to be doing a long series. I don't know how many videos it's going to be, but it's going to be a lot of a lot of videos, great content. And what we're going to be talking is basically knowing your pearl. Knowing your pearl is a whole series on identity and really understanding yourself, your core, what makes you, and where you're trying to go. I get it because you know what the pearl is. It's it makes it's a pearl that consists of sand and soot, and it makes this beautiful product at the end after all this pressure, and it's a pearl. And that's the thing about this whole process, which is so beautiful about life. You know, you're you're a combination of all the dirt, soot, grime, not just all the beautiful things, but you're all you're made of all the bad things too. And the thing is about knowing your pearl is really understanding what really makes you and the process of making a pearl is something that takes time. And with and with, with you being a human, that process is gonna end when you die. So you're gonna try and make the best pearl possible, but you need to know what's actually going into you and what's making this beautiful thing. Because we're all beautiful individuals. We all have, we're all made of the same kind of crap and we're all made of, you know, the good and bad. So, yeah. <laughs> and, you know, and that's the thing too, is and you're going into a sports environment or any environment, uh, at, you know, business environment, you're going to deal with pressures. And, you know, just like that pearl, you want it to come out at the end to be a, a solid product at the end. And it's important to know, you know, like you were saying, the good and the bad. It's a good, it's important to know your strengths and your weaknesses and understanding all of these skills as you go on through your journey to build this pearl, which is, you know, the concept. Yes. And it's important to understand yourself and understanding how to really uh be critical of yourself, analyze yourself, and being able to basically just like you would go into a game and you would have uh, a, a scout sheet of the team that you're playing, right? But a big thing, the best teams, what they do is they have, um, what do you call it, where you basically self-analyze yourself. What are you doing in these games? Because the same thing we used to do in football, like right. what are we doing on first and ten? What are we doing on, like yeah. if they're giving us this? You have to be able to coach yourself and understand your strengths and weaknesses. What are you doing well? What are you doing bad? And you have to be able to do that unbiasedly as possible in order to win the game. Right. It's like a creative player, right? You got to look at all your look at your layers, look at your stats. You know, like uh, how is this person under is this person understanding the playbook well? You know, is this person are they are they fast? How is their recovery? Are they strong? Wrong. What kind of leader are they? And all of these things go into that. And you need to understand this. And when you understand all of these things about yourself, you can make adjustments and improve where you feel like you need improvement, right? Looking at yourself objectively. And and that that is what makes you a strong player. You don't necessarily need to be the strongest or the fastest. That in itself can make you the best player on the field. Also, too, it helps you to understand where you can be touched, where you can get hit, where where you need to have your walls up, or things that you probably need to avoid um, in certain areas. Because we all have our strengths and we all have our weaknesses. Everybody can be touched. You are not a perfect human being. No, perfection does not exist. Um, and when you're going into this environment dealing with people, situations, uh, media, whatever, you need to understand where your wall is weak, where there's no wall at all, and where your wall is strongest in order to make the best plan possible. So going forward, uh, we're going to be doing a series of videos, uh, specifically uh, the next series we're going to be talking more in depth about the importance of understanding your pearl. Um, if you like this, if you like this content, please like, comment, and subscribe. If you want to uh, check our, check us out or our course, please click the link in the description. Until the next show, peace. peace.